All right, let's settle the big debate. Autophagy versus ketosis. You hear these buzzwords everywhere in the health world, especially for weight loss. But what's the real difference and which one should you be focusing on? Is it fasting or is it the keto diet? Let's break it down. First up, ketosis. Think of this as the fat-burning state. Normally, your body loves to burn carbs for energy. It's easy. It's quick. But when you drastically cut your carb intake, like on a ketogenic diet, your body panics a little. It says, hey, where's my sugar? And starts looking for an alternative fuel source. That's when your liver steps in and starts breaking down fat into molecules called ketones. Your body then uses these ketones for energy. The bottom line? Ketosis is a metabolic state where your primary fuel is fat. This is great for steady energy, reduced cravings, and of course fat loss. Now let's talk about autophagy. This word literally means self-eating, which sounds a little creepy, but trust me, it's amazing. Autophagy is your body's natural built-in recycling program. It's like a cellular spring cleaning. Your cells identify old, damaged, or dysfunctional parts. Think misfolded proteins or worn-out organelles. And they gobble them up. They break them down into basic building blocks and reuse them to create new, healthy cell parts. This process is crucial for slowing down aging reducing inflammation and potentially preventing diseases. So how do you trigger these? For ketosis, it's all about diet. Low carb, high fat. For autophagy, the biggest trigger is fasting. When you stop eating for a period of time, your body senses a lack of incoming nutrients and ramps up its recycling process to conserve energy and clean house. Here's the million dollar question. Which is better for weight loss? Well, ketosis is a direct fat burning strategy. You're literally telling your body to burn fat for fuel 24-7. Autophagy isn't directly a weight loss tool. It's more of a cellular health and repair mechanism. But here's the beautiful secret. They aren't enemies, they're best friends. When you fast long enough to trigger autophagy, you've also depleted your glucose stores, which naturally pushes you into ketosis. And if you're already on a keto diet, your body can enter autophagy much faster when you do decide to fast. So it's not autophagy versus ketosis, it's autophagy and ketosis. For powerful, sustainable fat loss and incredible metabolic health, the ultimate strategy is to combine them. Use a well-formulated ketogenic diet to become a fat-burning machine, and then incorporate intermittent or extended fasting to trigger that deep cellular cleanup. You get the weight loss from ketosis and the anti-aging, health-boosting benefits from autophagy. It's the ultimate one-two punch for transforming your body and your health.